What's going on YouTube? It's the iPod Expert 101, and in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make your iPod Touch or your iPhone work as if it was an iPad. Now, what I mean by as if it was an iPad is if you take a look at the lock screen, this is your basic lock screen. And if you guys know, the iPad can uh, turn sideways and do all that. You can rotate it whatever way you want, and the screen will follow it. So, with the two tweaks I'm about to show you guys in CDL again you need to be jailbroken you will be able to do whatever the iPad can do um, for rotation wise so I can now rotate my screen just like that let me zoom in here so now my iPod touch is working just like the iPad And not only does the lock screen change, but the springboard can also rotate depending on which way you turn your device as well. As you can see, you can turn it upside down, this way, uh, normal, or sideways. The icons do look a little cramped, but you will have shouldn't have any problem trying to uh, activate an app. So if I wanted to choose this photo right in the middle see that still works and also if you're in safari and uh... Oops, multitasking also goes in this mode as well so again you just need two tweaks from Cydia and a source you're gonna have to add and you'll be able to do just like I showed you here and your device will work like an iPad. Let me turn it off so you guys look at the lock screen again. Hey, so there you are. I don't know why, but I like it in this uh, rotation better. I kind of always wanted it to be in landscape, just like the iPad. It feels more spacious. And uh, yeah, so let's get into how to get it. I'm gonna open up Cydia. I'll let that load. I'm going to have to turn my iPod back around. Once it is done loading, you're going to go into Manage. You're going to go into Sources. And then you're going to Edit and Add a Source. The source you will add is repo dot insanely I repo well scratch that uh screwed up on the source the source is insanely sorry about that guys insanely I repo dot com Did I spell that right no repo's wrong Seeing that, there you go. Seeing that I repo dot com. Uh, the source will also be down in the description. And then you're going to hit add source. And then let it add. And then what you're going to want to do is go into the search tab. And type in SB rotator. Kind of having spelling issues here. Be rotator. There you go. Then all this will come up. Zoom in a little bit. So they will charge you if you don't have the source. The source allows you to get it for free. So if you guys are on four point whatever firmware, you're gonna hit the SB rotator for four point whatever firmware. If you guys are on three point whatever you guys are going to hit the SB rotator for 3.0 or 3. Point whatever and that will allow you to let your springboard rotate whatever way you want it to and the next tweak we're going to have to get is the LS rotator this will allow your lock screen to turn whatever way you want so this is a tweak Case it's free. 
and uh, you're just gonna install that and you will have to respring your device I think for bolt tweaks I'm not sure but that's how you get it and again it's real cool so you can do all these kind of things with your iPod let's go into the uh, managing the tweak so go into settings after you um, install the tweaks then you're gonna scroll down and you should see LS rotator and SB rotator so if you wanna manage whatever you want click on whatever you want I'm gonna show you guys SB rotator how to manage it so enable rotation means if you want it to rotate or not so if it's off then you won't be able to rotate you wanna leave that on and rotation duration uh, determines how fast it rotates so the higher it is the slower the screen will rotate so you want to keep it low and landscape rotation on portrait rotation on yeah so going into the uh, oops LS rotator got the iPad lock bars on iPad knob I'm not sure what that does but you also got the rotation duration again on this Again, you want to keep it low so it rotates as fast as it can. And that's just the uh, settings for these two rotators tweaks. So, hope you guys liked the video. Don't forget to uh, subscribe to me, like the video, leave a comment on what you think about the tweaks. Or if you have any problems with getting it, just leave it below. I will answer it as soon as possible. Check out my channel for more videos on tech similar to this. And I probably will be making another video right after this. It's probably going to be an app review or something like that. I'm not sure. But peace out, guys, and enjoy your day.